Hi, Collective. This is Tiffany and Tip Tip One. Hey, guys. Just want to see what we got going on in this energy. I hope you're having a beautiful day. Let's see, my loves. We got your baby father. This karmic masculine is in your energy. Mm. This baby father, when your baby father and your sister-in-law, okay, went to a dark high priest to perform black magic on you. Both of them are being haunted by your ancestors now. Death is near for these two. Because these two came into your family and sacrificed your mother and your grandmother. And these two here tried to come in and sacrifice you. Okay? They went to a dark high priest recently. Your baby father and your sister-in-law working together. Okay? All right? Because your sister-in-law went to the doctor and found out that she don't have that much time to live. She was trying to sacrifice you so she could live a longer life. Because she know you're a chosen one. Your karmic sister-in-law was placed... But your karmic sister-in-law was married to your karmic brother. Okay? But your karmic sister-in-law is a mason. She's a demon. And she knew who you was from when you was a child. Huh? Your crackhead brother. Okay? And they both had you in this MK Ultra program since you was a child. You and your children. Any children that you bear, these two, your, your crackhead brother and your sister-in-law tried to sacrifice you too. All right? Okay? And your fucking baby father was involved in this whole plot on your life. They all are masons. They all are in, to, in this shit together trying to take you down, Chosen. Okay? I'm telling you, this is what's going on in the energy. Spirit told me this morning that your baby father is working with your sister-in-law because they both are sick from that black magic they've been performing on you for many years. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so your sister-in-law went to the doctor and she found out that she don't have that much time to live. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, she did. So they came to fucking sacrifice you. They have the nerve, the audacity to come into your life and sacrifice your grandmother, sacrifice your mother, and then try to sacrifice you. These fucking masons. Okay, they've been doing spell work on you, chosen ones, for a long time. These two here. All right, once you left this baby father, this baby father has been working with your sister-in-law, your karmic brother, and your family to do black magic on you, okay? And both of them are being haunted by your ancestors. Death is definitely near. Mm-hmm. Yeah, your ancestors not playing around with you. These people thought they were going to come in your life and sacrifice you for your inheritance. Try to take your light so they could pass it on to she, your karmic sister-in-law, trying to take your light so she could pass it on to her children. Like, what? Trying to take your destiny away from you. This fucking mason, this fucking demon hoe bitch here. Yeah, she's passing away. Mm-hmm. She's passing away. Sold your baby father. Because that death magic, black, that death magic backfired. They continue to go to dark high priests to do spell work on you. And it don't work. Hmm. Jealous motherfuckers here. Yeah, your nephew. Wow. Your nephew, your comic brother, sister, your comic brother, son. This is not your sister-in-law, son. This is your brother, son. Your comic brother. Your half-brother. Okay? Your nephew is passing away from a terminal disease. Okay? Because your nephew went against you, too. In 2017 to 2022. They was behind the scenes. Your nephew was working with these dark high pieces against you, too. All right? Because this person is sick. And this person thought they was going to sacrifice you. So they could be well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. I just heard I just heard somebody's nephew crying. I was in the shower saying they they saying they um they sorry for what they have done to you. Okay? Because they passing away. Mm-hmm. You didn't do nothing to this person. You love this nephew. You love your comic brother son. Okay? You love your comic brother son. And this person portrayed you and worked with this fucking Masons, these fucking Illuminati here, this fucking occult to take you out, to sacrifice you. Because they all wanted a, um, a healthier life. Mm-hmm. They want to be healthy in this lifetime while you be sick and gone. And that didn't work. Okay, so your comic nephew, his comic brother, your comic brother son, which is not your sister-in-law son. He had this son by another woman. Okay, yeah, he's passing away. From a terminal disease. And it's unfortunate. Because what he had tried to do to you. Your, his mother went to a dark high priest. 
your comic nephew's mother went to a dark high priest to sacrifice you and it backfired. She unlocked her own child. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she did. She um I heard um she puts she puts the um the time from him further, like closer. Trying to sacrifice you. She went to a dark eyed priest. Well, your baby father and your sister in law went to a dark eyed priest and your comic nephew mother, okay, went to a dark eyed priest, okay, recently, maybe yesterday, to do death spells on you so they could be saved. Mm. It shit backfired. These people are passing away. That's what I heard Spirit say. Yeah, because they should have left you alone. They didn't have the right to. They don't have the. You high rank in here. You a high priest. Mm hmm and you're chosen and they should have left you alone they can't sacrifice you chosen they be sacrificing their own self this comic nephew his mother okay your baby your, your comic father i mean your comic brother baby mother who he had uh, this child with she went to a dark high priest to do spell work on you to sacrifice you and she she fucked up and she she unalive she's unalive in her own son Cause that black magic went backfired on your on her son on your nephew. Mhm. Mm yeah, she fucked up. She should have left you alone. Okay. Yeah, these people are liars and they watching you tell the truth. Yeah, they watching you tell the truth. These people are liars. They watching you. Yeah, this is a huge betrayal. This was an ultimate betrayal. Ultimate betrayal. Okay. All these motherfuckers been cloned in the early two thousand. Your whole family. Okay. Your whole family. Yeah. They said they tried to assassinate you. Mm-hmm. Wow, this is the message. Your sister-in-law found out that she had a terminal disease. Did I tell you? I picked this up this morning. Spirit talked to me. Spirit told me about your nephew, your sister-in-law, and your baby father. They all in cahoots. Okay? All in cahoots. They all went to a dark high priest to try to take you out here. Mm-hmm. For no reason, cause they trying to get well, and they killing themselves. They killing themselves. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Your sister found out that she have a terminal disease, and she would she don't have that much time left. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Your sister-in-law went to a doctor and found out that she have don't have that much time left. Mm-mm. -mm. Yeah. All right, and your baby father and sister-in-law, they both went to a dark high priest because these are the two outsiders of the family. Your sister-in-law is your brother's wife. Your baby father is your baby father. These are two motherfucking outsiders came into your world, to into your family, and tried to sacrifice you, chosen one. Mm. That was a bad mistake. This was the hugest betrayal ever, and they had your comic nephew, your comic brother's son, Okay, working against you too. And you love these people. You took care of these people. You thought these people was for you. This was a huge portrayal. That's why your nephew is passing away and your sister-in-law and your baby father. Mm, mm -mm. Yeah, this was a conspiracy on your life, man. Yeah, you're fearless. You ain't scared of shit. And that's what they can see. Yeah, your angels is watching over you. Your ancestors, God is protecting you from this fucking huge betrayal. They thought they was gonna murder you here. Yeah, you stood up for yourself. You stood, yeah, you stood for the test of time here. This is a lot of black magic thrown at you, okay? A lot of black magic. Hmm. Yeah, they tried to assassinate you. Do black magic. They didn't know that you was the high, highest, the highest piece of all. Hmm. Yeah, your comic nephew, you are protected from this this coven here, okay? Your comic nephew um, is maybe gay. Some of y'all take it as a resonate, and this person was sleeping around with ten transgenders, okay? And they, they and this person was, um, this comic nephew who's passing away was sleeping with transgenders, all right? And they didn't want you to expose them, but you didn't give a fuck about they sexual preference. You didn't never care about any of these people's sexual preference. They ain't got nothing to do with you. You don't want to be nothing around. You don't want to be around none of these people. Once you realize that this fucking family members betrayed you, you got the fuck out, okay? And left these people alone. 
Hmm. Yeah. And let these people alone. And it's definitely going to be a death in your family. I'm telling you. It's going to be a death in your family. It's going to be a death. It's up to you if you want to go to the funeral. Hmm. Yeah. They ain't have no reason to. They didn't have no right to try to attack and take you out, Starseed. Hmm. Thank you, Spirit. Saturday meeting. The Saturday meeting they had had. They, this Saturday meeting has been postponed. They know they are being watched by the feds and the FBI planning on moving locations and dates. Okay? Because they know. They know they're being watched by the feds now. All right? Your family members know they're being watched by the feds. So those Saturday meetings, we are 10 steps, 100 steps ahead of these fucking people. All right? Yeah, these Saturday meetings they've been having, they're going to postpone it. This Saturday coming. They're going to try to move location. They're going to try to move the date. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're going to figure it out. We're going to know exactly what day they're going to have this meeting. Huh. Yeah, Spirit going to tell me. <laughs> yeah, they was having them Saturday meetings. They're going to postpone it. Mm-hmm. They're going to postpone it. Yeah, your anointed bothered them. The anointed bothered the fuck out of his sister-in-law, your baby father, and your nephew. And that's why they came against you. Okay? And worked against you to try to sacrifice you. Because they thought they was going to fucking inherit your gifts. Your spiritual inheritance. Like, what? Y'all some fucking outsiders. Y'all some fucking devils here. Okay? Y'all have, have the fucking right to even touch you. And your family. Hmm. These fucking bottom feeders here. Yeah. They raised spiritual warfare on you, collective. Yes, they did. This fucking comic baby father and your fucking nephew and your sister-in-law. Fucking outsiders of the family. Coming after you? Huh. Yeah, 555. Five, five. Unexpected change is coming. You're about to have a happy life, happy family. Okay? These people are coming out your energy forever. Yeah. I'm trying to sacrifice you and steal money from you. Steal inheritance from you. And these fuck these are outsiders. This baby father's a fucking outsider. And so is this sister in law. Fucking thieves. Hmm. Yeah, God stepped in. Our Lord and Savior. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for being here. Thank you, God. Yeah, your family, this baby father and this sister-in-law sending a handle to control your every move. A hitman. Okay? And that shit backfired. Hmm. That hitman couldn't take you out. Yeah. That hitman couldn't take you out. That black magic couldn't take you out either. They caused them their own death. Yeah. Some elders in the energy. Your sister-in-law and your baby father could be elderly. They could be in their 60s. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the feds is on them. Their feds is on these fucking people. Yeah. This is a reek on your community. And your baby father and your sister-in-law and your nephew was a part of this fucking Rico. Hmm. But they was behind the scenes still t doing spell work on you. Okay? But I feel your nephew, mother, okay, went to a dark card piece because her son is passing away. Okay? And she tried to use you as a sacrificial lamb so her son could live well. She caused her son a death. I'm telling you. Yeah, God got plans for you. His word is never voided, baby. Hmm. God is protecting you from this covenant. Yeah. Yeah. I'm telling you. God is protecting you from this covenant. For all this black magic and shit trying to make you sick. Hmm. Are you serious? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, these people are Eastern stars. Masons, Eastern Stars, they thieves. Your sister-in-law, your brother, I mean, yeah, and your brother, okay? And your baby father, all right? Thieves, okay? Hmm. Yeah, they have a criminal mindset here. They're criminals. they fucking criminals. Your mother's watching you, and she is so proud of you that you're exposing these motherfuckers. Hmm. Because they sacrifice your mother for her money. And your brother and your fucking sister-in-law, your baby father... Okay? Was down with this shit. And your fucking nephew. Huh. Yeah, because they were jealous of you all. They were jealous of you and your mother. This coven here. Mm-hmm. They were jealous of you and your mother. Because y'all was anointed. Y'all are anointed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The whole community came against you and your mom. Mm -hmm. And your family members, too. And they thought they was going to sacrifice you like they, sac like they sacrificed your mother. But your mother's here in spirit. You are your mother. Huh. Huh. They can't kill y'all both. You hear? Huh. 
Your mother could have been an Aries. Mm hmm Yeah, you reincarnated to your mom. Hmm. You reincarnated, you got a reincarnation to your mother of your mom. You your mom. You your grandmother. Yeah, this family is scared of shit. They can see it. Mm-hmm. They thought they were going to sacrifice you and that you were going to die. They did sacrifice you many of times. They did black magic on you. Spell work, boot work. They did sacrifice you. You didn't die from that magic. You can't die, Earth Angel. Hmm. From no magic. Yeah. Your karmic mother was involved. Your father's, um, your father's girlfriend, but because your stepmother, your mother's here to take her out because she was involved with stealing, um, she was involved with unaliving your mother and she was involved to try to, um, she was involved with stealing your money and she was involved to try to sacrifice you. They all was in cahoots together, this whole fucking family here. Mm-hmm. Sorry asses. Yeah, this copycat bitches. Yeah, your stepmother is a copycat bitch. She was jealous of your energy. She wanted to be you. Hmm. That shit is ridiculous. And she sacrificed your mother because she wanted to be your mother too. This fucking demon here. Yeah, your mother coming for her. This cop, your comic father, your comic mother, your baby, your stepmother, your comic father's girlfriend who helped sacrifice your mother sick. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they being haunted. I'm telling you, Spirit was talking this morning. Hmm. What else you got here, spirit? Raise your spiritual warfare on you. Huh. Yeah, they want to get back in your energy because they need your energy to survive. Yeah, no, fuck your family. Huh. Yeah, they're going to be depleted. They will never be back in your energy. All right? Hmm. Your family's going to send in an old friend to ask you some questions. Don't answer the door for this person. Access is denied. You are being cloaked by God. Nobody can't come in your energy. No more. Hmm. No more. Alright. You're being cloaked by God here. Yeah. Mm -mm. They're trying to send you anxiety attacks. This that's what they was doing as well in this at this dark high priest. Okay? They want to go visit a dark high priest. All of these motherfucking people. All right, they trying to send you some type of anxiety attacks because this is exactly what they going through. That shit backfired. You don't feel shit. You chilling. Hmm. Yeah, they sacrificed your mother from over over money. Your comic father and your fucking stepmother. Your baby father and your brother and sister-in-law. Huh. Some of y'all going to probate court. They stole your house too. Yeah, they, it, was a, it was all over fucking life insurance that your real grandmother left you. Your real mother left you. Hmm. Life insurance? You have to sacrifice the people for life insurance? Hmm. And raging spiritual warfare on you? Okay, it's about $800,000. Thank you, spirit. Hmm. Your money. This is what they was coming after you for. Okay? Yeah, the copycat bitch got locked up. Because she was involved in this shit too, this blow up bitch. Your family members had coming for you. Yeah, they tried to steal. They stealing something from you. They were stealing this money from you. They all going to fucking jail. Thank you, spirit. Hmm. The comics, the comics grouping up together to help this blow up bitch sabotage you. Okay? They grouping up together right now to try to sabotage you somehow. And it's not going to work. Okay? They were snakes in your life. All of these motherfuckers, they passing away. Huh. Yeah, I told you from 2016 oh, to 2024, these people been plotting and scheming on you. Yeah, your comic sister-in-law who's passing away from this terminal disease now. Okay, and your baby father and father and this fucking um, comic mother. Okay, stepmother has you in this MK Ultra program. You and your children. Okay? Hmm. And they're trying to fucking abandon you and live off your fucking inheritance. Mm-mm. Ain't going down like that, baby. Ain't going down like that. Hmm. Thank you, spirit. Yeah. Yeah, they, this is the message. They tried to assassinate you. They may have sent in a hitman to take you out. I feel as that blow up, bitch. Okay? These are all murderers here. I'm telling you. They masons as well, too. Hmm. Yeah. These people are trying to take you out of a life insurance. Ain't because you're gifted. The feds are involved, collector. The feds are sending the agents to post up and watch you. All right? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. What else we got here, Spirit? Somebody gonna end up missing here. I feel as that blow up bitch. They coming for her. Huh. They coming for her. The people, how, these people. Okay, the people who she working with. Hmm. It's, they coming for her. They, don't, they want her gone. These soulless motherfuckers. Your karmic father gonna take out this bitch. She may be your sister. This blow up bitch. Okay? They, mm-mm. They, what? What? They hiring a highly trained hitman to take this comic bitch out. Okay? I'm telling you. Mm. Mm-mm. Yeah, because she couldn't take you out. They gotta, they're gonna sacrifice one of their own. It is gonna be this comic bitch. We done picked that up already. This whole coven that she's affiliated with is gonna turn on her. They're gonna take her the fuck out. That's how it goes, baby. Mm-hmm. Your comic father. This comic bitch may be your sister. May be your half sister. Okay? This may be your real father, but this person is comic. Okay? And he trying to have his fucking your comic sister, his secret child, which could be his comic daughter. Okay? All right? Trying to take you out here so she could walk in your life. That shit didn't work. They're going to turn his... Yo, y'all, these people are some backstabbers, some real steak, some real grimy-ass motherfuckers. These people are... This, they're going to sacrifice your your cat sister, this blow-up bitch. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, this is the organized crime. They organized a crime to take this bitch out. So, I'm telling you. Mm-hmm. Somebody woke in the comments said, um, yesterday, I thought they was coming for her. They coming. This, this a cult that she's affiliated with. Huh? Yeah, they coming. Yeah. I'm telling you, this a cult she's affiliated with. I'm going to organize a hitman to take her out. Whoo! Yeah. So this is a conspiracy on your life. Okay? Hmm. It's here. The angels and ancestors turned shit around for you. Yeah. Your, all your childhood friends came against you for money. They all being taken out too. Oh, well. They all clones any fucking way. They were sent in the organ traffic you, organ harvest you, high priest. Huh. Now they know what it is. Huh. Yeah. So your nephew is sick. Mm-hmm. His mother tried to go to a high priest. Probably this over this weekend. To go to a dark priest to sacrifice you. So her son can live. She don't... Mm. She underlock her own son. You hear me? Mm, mm, mm. This is crazy. Yeah, these clones didn't know who the fuck you was. You're her goddess and god here. You're a high priest. All right? And the dark high priest knows this. All the dark high priests, when they look into your records, okay, they know you're a high priest. And they know not to perform any type of black magic on you. Because they know the outcome of this situation. Yeah, but these fucking desperate ass people here don't give a fuck. They will try anything to sacrifice you so they can live well. Huh. Yeah, this is mm, no way in hell. Raging so much spiritual warfare on you. Because you're chosen? Hmm. Yeah. They should know better. These devils, these heathens, these fucking heathens here, these Luciferians. Hmm. Warlocks. Your baby father, a warlock. Your brother, a warlock. Your comic father, a warlock. And was going around town saying that you was a fucking witch. You a high priest. You trump all these motherfuckers. Yeah, they can't beat you here. Told you. Your knock ass baby father. And his baby and, and your knock your narcissistic boyfriend. Baby mother is doing spell work on you. So if you have a narcissistic, if you was dealing with a narcissistic masculine, his baby mother doing spell work on you. What the fuck? Mm-hmm. She don't want you to beat up. You don't want to, this. I feel that you broke up with this narc ass ex boyfriend of yours. It could be your baby father, but his baby mother is doing spell work on you. Like what the hell? Your comic father paid a dark high priest to look into your Akashic records. I'm telling you, this is what they've been doing over the weekend. 
and then try to perform um, black magic on you. But this, it don't go nowhere. This dark eyed piece, no. All the dark eyed pieces, I feel it's three of them they have went to. Okay, no not to do no spell break on you. Mm-hmm. You're leveling one up. You're leveling one up. You are high frequency at this time. No spell work is going to work on you. You in alignment for great things to come. Okay, all your answers is, all your prayers is being answered at this time. You wanted these people out your energy, and that's where they're going to be. Out your energy. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Call up this. No way in hell. Yeah, they try. They plot. They they plotted to kill you, to take you out, to get rid of you. Your brother was involved too, and your sister-in-law. Mm -mm. <laughs> this blower bitch already in jail. Yeah, this blower bitch is already in jail. Somebody, one of y'all blow up bitches is already in jail. She trying to, wow, spirit. I'm telling you, yo. Yo, she's trying to get expedited out the country. You picked that up yesterday or the day before yesterday, okay? She trying to get away. One of y'all blow up bitches is trying to get away. She trying to get expedited out the country because, you know, this criminal ring, this criminal organization want her gone. And they're going to they gonna take her out. She ain't going nowhere. They're going to take her out. Yeah? Mm. She forging documents and shit like that. She forging documents. Yeah, she has some higher-ups. Some force-ass higher-ups helping her try to get excited out the country. And it's not going to work. It's not looking good for this bitch. Yeah, I'm telling you, they hired... Wow. They hired a highly trained hitman to, um, to take you out. But I feel like they hired a highly trained hitman to take this blow-up bitch out. Mm-hmm. They gonna sacrifice her. Cause they tried they tried to she couldn't sacrifice you. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. You breaking generations of curses here, collective. Yeah, you breaking this curse off your generation here. Your mother's here in spirit. Thank you, mommy, for being here. Thank you, mommy, for being here. Mm. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, they scared now. The whole coven. They scared. <laughs> they fucking scared now. Yeah, this is adult abuse on your life, Collective. You didn't deserve it. You did not deserve it. Now they fucking being abused. All right? Now they being abused. <clears throat> by your ancestors, by God. All right? Yeah, they obsessed with your energy. They obsessed with you, this whole coven. They trying to human traffic you. That shit backfired. Okay? The, um, the feds know about this human trafficking, organ trafficking. Hmm. Your nephew's on heavy drugs at this time. That's what I just heard. Trying to cope with this disease. Mm-hmm. Mm. I feel your nephew is saying, can we please work it out? This person wants your forgiveness. This is a comic masculine, your nephew. I'm telling you. Mm -mm. They were soulless. This person had um, a dark energy on them from a child. That's what I heard. And I feel your mother and your grandmother paid, prayed for this. Pray for your um, the narcissistic nephew. Okay? He was he was abandoned by his mother for being bisexual gay. We love gay people. Okay? And his mother um, shunned him, honestly. All right, so he was he grew up narcissist. But for your mother and your grandmother, nourished this boy, took care of this boy, and he, and and you too took care of this nephew, and you loved on him. Your mother accepted him for who he was, okay. You accepted him for who he was, and he turned against you, okay, due to this coven here, all right. But now his mother. Your comic nephew mother now went to a dark high priest to try to sacrifice you. So her son could live a healthier life. It's not happening. It's, it's not going to work out for her. It's not going to work out for him too. And he knows that. He's going to ask you for your forgiveness. Probably telepathically. You may hear this person crying out and asking for forgiveness for you. From you. Okay. For what he tried to do. Because he knows this is the cause of his death. He know because of what he planned to do to you. 
was planning to do to you. And that was to unalive you, collective. Yo. Mm, mm, mm. I can't. I just can't. Yeah, justice is being served, collective. Justice is being served here. Mm. Mm. What else we got here? They looking at you like you the Antichrist. They was turning this blow up bitch into the Antichrist. She was supposed to honest all your gifts, okay, and use them for wicked shit. Mm hmm. To be the devil here. All right? That shit backfire. God Trump, bitch. God Trumps. Okay? Yeah, you using your gifts to help humanity here. Okay? Help souls. This is what you was. This is what you, your destined path is. Okay? Hmm. Yeah, you took this coven down. Mm-hmm. Something about phone service. So they may they may have went to a phone company to get you get your um phone hack into your phone. Okay, they found out the phone company that you was working I mean that you affiliated with and they went and tried to get your um your call log and shit like that. For what reason? Like they wanna know if you know these backstabbers. They want to know what you're doing behind the scenes. This is, They want to know how the fuck they're getting caught up. And they want to know why all the fucking attacks is not touching you. They want to know who you working with. You working with God. <laughs> yeah, you working with God. A celebrity is watching you. Mm-hmm. A celebrity is watching you. Yeah, your, your hitman. Your hitman. Your family sent in a hitman to unalive you. All right. They was into this underground shit here. Okay? They did crimes against animals. They're going to be slaughtered the same way they did with these fucking animals. They're going to be slaughtered the same way. Hmm. Yeah, they did death spells on you. Anybody who's doing death spells on you will pass away. I'm telling you. I saw your nephew, um... I saw your nephew endure pedophilia while he was a child. Yeah. And it turned him narcissist. It turned him... Um, promiscuous. Alright. I think some, some gay people have went through this as a child. Okay. And this altered their whole being, man. And. He, he, he. I don't know. It's just like. He just became a narcissist. Instead of healing from that trauma. All right, and since she was the anointed one around him, he was projecting out his trauma onto you, collective. This nephew, I I really I really think he was ex he experienced pedophilia as a child from another masculine. Mhm. Mm yeah, and he's another one who went through that kind of childhood trauma. And his mother tried to cover it up. Okay? And then and protect him. Mm hmm Now she wanna be on doing some black magic on you. Okay, to try to save her child. You you unalobbing your child even faster, child. So that black magic gonna backfire on him. Mm-hmm. Wow, collective. Your comic father went to a family member's House to try to discuss how to get you back your money. I feel your comic father went to a family member house today. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they went to... They went to your... Your comic father went to somebody's house today. Mm-hmm. I just was thinking about this, too. Your comic family member tried to lock you up in an asylum and say that you was mental to steal your money. That shit didn't work. That's why they scared. They couldn't keep you locked up forever. They couldn't keep you locked up forever. Mm-hmm. They scared now. They thought they was going to have you in a mental ward. Okay? For a long time. Some of y'all just happened to take it as a resume. And it didn't work. It did not work. Mm-hmm. And the whole coven was down. I'm telling you, all of these people that we, I'm talking about right now was there helping your comic father lock you up in a fucking mental ward. That could continue to steal your money. And they all was there when the fucking cops came. And the, the, the ambulance came to put you away. Okay? It was a plot and a scheme to get rid of you. That shit didn't work. They all going down. They all going down, baby. And then they try to do spell work on top of that. 
Mm mm. Yeah, now your neighbors are scared to go outside. Your neighbors is down with it too. They always out there watch you get locked up. Okay, go into an ambulance, put you in a psych ward or whatever. You know, your nephew, mother was there. Your baby father was there. Your ne your neighbors is there. Your father, your comic father was there. I'm telling you. And around that time that you was in that psych ward, they were stealing money. They going down, they going down. The feds know all about it. That's what they fucked up at. They made this for support to get you locked up. They fucked up on that. Okay? It triggered the whole shit up. They caught themselves up with that shit. Yeah, because the feds and the FBI started to dig into the case. Because I swear to you, somebody want to come confess now. Yeah. They, the feds, the FBI, the police started to dig into... It was a big thing. Police came for you. The hospital came for you. Ambulance came for you. So they don't think, this fucking dumbass cover don't think that, that what you're doing, get to the psych ward, and then they, the, 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 the doctors are going to run tests on you and see that you are fucking normal. Okay? <laughs> All right? But around that time, they were stealing money from you. So they probably looking for the money now. They probably think they're getting this money. No, they going to jail for this money. Mm-hmm. They thinking it's coming to them because they money it was money laundering. Like I said, they going to jail for this money. Confinement. They going to prison. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because around the time this whole coven put you locked up in the psych ward, that's the time they were stealing inheritance from you. Yeah, and then they trying to unalive you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they all got blood on their hands now. They being watched. They going to jail for this money. Mm. This whole fucking occult. Yeah, people are passing away too from that death magic. Don't trust nobody at this time. They in rage. They scared. They in rage. They would do anything to try to take you out here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just comic sister-in-law or comic sister. All right. They all work with the government against you. They all did. They all did. All right. Your family members. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-mm. Yeah, and I remember they tried to put me in a psych ward collector. They all are. Who, all these people that I'm mentioning here was right outside watching me going to an ambulance. Yeah, I was laughing at them, though. Because I already knew the outcome of this shit. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I could go away for a little while. I don't mind. That's what God wanted me to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, somebody got married in your name. This blow-up bitch. And probably your baby father. So I'm looking at baby father right here. Okay. Your comic twin. Or, or this could be a comic to a comic soulmate. Okay? Got married in your name to this blow-up bitch to steal your inheritance. They all getting locked up. Mm-hmm. All right? Your family's put your information on the dark web. Okay? Violated your fucking privacy. Yes, they did. They going to jail for that, too. Hmm. It's being detected. Yeah, anything going down with you is being protected. I'm telling you. Hmm. It's being exposed. You are high conscious. That's what they scared of. Hmm. Some of y'all time traveling. Okay, you see the outcome of this whole occult going down. Yeah, God is showing you. God is showing you. Hmm. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, you know the outcome. You know what's going on. These people are going to jail. Some are passing away. Yeah. It's going to be a, um, it's going to be a funeral. It's going to be a funeral. What else you got here, spirit? Give me one more. Yeah, these people was abusive and manip manipulative. All of these people, very abusive. Mm-hmm. Mm. Thank you, spirit. This whole occult abuse you. And they about to be fucking abused. You hear me? Hmm. They going to jail for embezzlement. Racketeering, money laundering. Hmm. Thank you, spirit. Hmm. Mm -mm. God has promised that all things will not some will work out in your favor, collective. I'm telling you. Huh. This is it. 
<laughs> this is it. Mm. Mm. This is it for these fucking clones. All right, collective. I love you guys so much. I'll be back on for another download, love. Later, boom.